We're here to celebrate Catherine and the Bill's wedding day. This is a celebration of their unbreakable bond, the love they share with each other, and the love we all have for them. And what a celebration this is, what a beautiful day, with the most important people in their lives here. Their mothers, of course, Clarissa and Asma, their siblings, extended family and friends who are here from near and far. First, I'd like to thank everyone in attendance for being here and supporting Kay and Nabil on their special day. I know that it means so much to them because I personally heard them say to each other how happy they were that people made an effort to travel here just for them. There are two great men who shaped the type of people that we've come to know in, in Catherine and Nabil. Their fathers, Adolfo and Mohammed. Their memories are truly, truly a blessing. Kay is one of the most caring, thoughtful, funny, smart, and wise person I know. And I am so happy she now gets to share her life with Nabil, someone who is equal in character. I've witnessed Nabil's transformation from a young, enthusiastic boy to a fully grown man, fulfilled man, strong, opinionated, generous, and thoughtful. He's the one we turn to for advice company and spirited debates. <laughs> <laughs> Whether it's discussing movies, video games, or sharing life stories, Nab's wisdom shines through. Dearest Nabil, every day I get to know you more and more. I am amazed by your smarts and endless curiosity. You're adventurous and always up to travel anywhere and everywhere. Your patience and consideration for me and for others is admirable. You have the kindest heart and are so generous with your time and love. Dear Kat, I actually struggle to put into words everything I feel for you. I love you so much. I never thought I'd have the chance to marry someone so pretty, so smart, so kind. I honestly have trouble realizing I found someone so perfect. I still remember our first date, January 2020, <laughs> just two months before the pandemic. I remember I had a rule of only reserving one hour for first dates. One hour. Broke it. <laughs> <laughs> yep, but with you, we ended up talking the whole evening. We closed down Horse Feather on Divisadero. Love at first sight when I looked in those <laughs> eyes. All those years ago. I remember when she first told me about you. I think you guys had maybe traveled together early on in the relationship. And I was like, who is this guy? <laughs> <laughs> but then she texted me a picture of you two together. And I just thought you had like, the kindest looking face. <laughs> And I could see that my sister was really happy. And then I met you, and you were even better than expected. Your love is out of this world. Last year during Valentine's Day, you planned such a beautiful weekend for us. Dinners, wine tasting, train ride. And then you surprised me with a private hot air balloon ride where you got down on one knee and proposed. I wasn't expecting your proposal that day because I wasn't surprised with all the effort you put together and just what you do like on a regular weekend. I've seen them navigate their everyday life together from deciding where to travel to as mundane as how to cook dinner together and they truly work as great partners. I cannot imagine a more loving, respectful and supportive union than that of Kay and the Beatles. All I can see is really the change that you brought to this man. How complete now he, he, he seems. I know he's found his life companion, the one that will jump into his, all his silliness. Uh, you are amazing and you guys are partners that can weather any storm together. I have so much fun with you. We have a saying, we, when we're done with work and ready to relax, we call it the best part of the day. I just feel like that whenever I'm with you. I 
it is without any doubt. This is one of the easiest decisions for me to make. To commit to you, to say I do, and to love you for the rest of my life. I promise to support you in all your dreams and ambitions. I promise to give you the benefit of the doubt because I know you have the biggest heart. I promise to be silly so I can hear you laugh every day. I promise to learn how to speak French. <laughs> <laughs> Je promets de prendre le français. <laughs> And I promise to love you the way you are today and who you will be tomorrow. I want to make you smile whenever you're sad. <laughs> Carry you around when the dance floor is red. <laughs> All I want to do is grow old with you. I'll get you medicine when your tummy aches. Entertain you when the Wi-Fi breaks. <laughs> it could be so nice growing old with you. I'll miss you, kiss you, give you my coat when you are cold. <laughs> Need you feed you. I'll even put down the game control. <laughs> I'll let you do the dishes in the kitchen sink, <laughs> but only if I cooked all the meals this week. <laughs> I could be the man, grow old with you. Catherine and Nabil, you declared your commitment to each other, you spoke from the heart and shared your promises, your rings are now on your fingers. On this beautiful, beautiful day, I am happy and honored to pronounce you married, you may kiss. <laughs> Nabil, <laughs> I'm so happy to have you as my brother-in-law. As some of you may know, my dad passed away a couple of years ago. Um, so I am really in, in here to, really, to represent my, my dad. Um, I remember my dad would always talk to my sister and whenever she would have a problem, he would say, Anak, huwag ka nang mag which would mean, you know, child, don't, don't worry about it, I got your back. So whenever she would have a problem, my dad would say that. Um, now that he's not around, um, I don't think he has anything to worry about now because now Catherine has Nabil to take, her, take care of that part. So, my, to, so to my dad, I want to tell him, Daddy, what can I Nabil is there for, for Catherine. And I know my dad has the biggest smile up there in heaven looking down on us. So. Hold your hand, living life's what I come to love the most. And who knows where life will take us? I don't really know. 
But I got a feeling the best is yet to show. And I kept on the memories stored up in my heart. Let's still run and make some more like we did at the start. And who knows where life will take us? I don't really know. But I got a feeling that the best is yet to show. And I kept on the memories stored up in my heart. But there's room to make more like we did from the start. Let us toast to the two people who have brought us all here in this room together. 2K and Nabil, I wish you health, happiness, love, and everything you could ever wish for. And may you have years to enjoy them all as husband and wife. Congratulations, Kay and I can't wait to spend all my days, all my years with you because the best part of my day is always when I'm with you. I love you. <laughs>